Hey everyone, this is Holly from Studio H Salon and she is my 614 Fempreneur. Yes, <laughs> um, but before we get started with anything else, the most important question I have for Holly is, how does my hair look? Your hair looks great. Ah, oh, she said it looks great. I like the curls. Loving it already. All right, Holly, so go ahead and introduce yourself. Okay, I'm Holly, like she said, and I own Studio H in Grandview. Um, it'll actually be seven years in April that I've owned it. I've been doing hair for about 10 years. Um, that's it. Avid CrossFit junkie. Okay, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Great dog named Grace. Oh, can you guys see Grace? Grace oh, come there here. she is. Come here, Grace. Look, you can see her. You can see her in the background a little bit. She's super chill. She <laughs> And um, come get your koozies. Chaz complimentary on a hair service. Oh, I thought you were gonna let me take this one home. Oh yeah, you can have that one. Sucka. <laughs> <laughs> Who thinks you're beautiful when you wake uh -huh. up in the morning? My number one instinct would be my mother. However, I feel like my dog does talk to me. Gracie? Yeah, and she would tell me I'm pretty or beautiful, but I tell her that as well. We compliment each other. Okay, are you living your dream job or are you creating it? Um, I think I'm creating it. I don't know if a dream job really exists, but mm -hmm. I think we can do things that make us feel satisfied and good at the end of the day. Right. So I'm creating that here. Nice. In like my work establishment. Like, I feel like if I'm helping someone, I feel good at the end of the day. I love it. <laughs> okay. What would Beyonce do? Um, WWBD. Yeah, I'm not, I don't know. Whatever she feels like, that's. Well, when I asked this question before to you, you said the real question is what would Lady Gaga do? And Correct. I'm digging that question too. Yeah, I mean, so I, I feel follow like, more like her I life know, than I'm, Beyonce's I'm really life. getting a little bit more, like I might change my questions to what would Beyonce do? Yeah. What would Lady Gaga, what would she do though? I mean, I feel you like Lady Gaga is more impactful mm -hmm. than Beyonce right now. Yeah, and I, no offense, Queen Bee, we love you, girl. But yeah. I agree with your yeah, statement. Right. Okay, so what we're gonna get from that is what would Lady Gaga do? I feel like Lady Gaga, she would just sing something so great a cappella. She'd probably wanna pet my dog. She would definitely she would. want to be drinking a glass of wine with us right now. All those things. Yeah. And then she'd be watching this if she wasn't. Do you think that she would take a, a lollipop, a dum-dum? For sure. What do you think Lady Gaga's dum-dum preferred flavor would be? Mm. I've got two. I got two as well. Oh my I gosh. was thinking the but, traditional okay. butterscotch. Ooh. Or traditional. a new one is pineapple. I love it. Um, I was thinking lime or root beer, and I don't know why. I thought root beer for a second, too. It's probably root, root beer. beer. Yeah, for sure. Okay. <laughs> no picking. She's choking. <laughs> okay, what if there was a blank that could blank? Um. <laughs> cheating. I, I forget what I me. said for She's the answer. Here, just fucking take it. <laughs> Uh, oh, 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 I remember. Oh, okay, never mind. Okay, we'll take it back. She's got it. Um, I need my vet, Adam Parsons, that's you at North Star Animal Care in Ooh. Upper Arlington, to create veterinary a, plug. Yeah, to create a pill that makes my dog live as long as me. But not after, because then no one would feed it. As long as me. Just as long as you. Yeah, give me the same lifespan. Cause my life's balanced with grace. Some kind of like Romeo and Juliet of pills yeah, for, yeah. okay. I dig it. Yeah. I mean, I love dogs more than humans. I'm not insulted, actually. That's fine yeah. with me. Okay. Yep. So why are you worth knowing? Hmm, it's a hard question. Um. <laughs> Are you looking at me? Yeah, I can't remember. Oh, I'm a good therapist. Tell me your problems. Tell me more, okay. Sit in my chair, we'll talk about whatever you need to talk about, and I'm gonna help you out with your hair. 
So then you're feeling confident. You're feeling like you just got something off your chest, perhaps. And then your hair looks good at the same time. Okay, do you have a routine practice that helps kind of keep you in check, keep you balanced? Oh my goodness, yes. Tell me more. <laughs> Uh, I clearly love this thing called CrossFit, so any type of working out really helps with my anxiety, anything stress related. I'll just go to the gym, get a good sweat on, feel good, try and clear my head. Or I sometimes like to be creative, draw and paint, but most of the time I find myself at the gym. Is there anything else that you want to say? Anything about yourself? Anything about anything that you just want to say to you? The people. Blondes do have more fun. I mean, come on. I uh, love it. Yeah. That was like the best ending. Yeah. Oops, <laughs> I feel it coming. <laughs> All right, you guys. Holly Archer, Studio H Salon in Grandview. Such an awesome girl. I absolutely adore her. Got She's a good realtor too. Thank oh, thank you kindly. Um, got to know her a little bit when I sold her her gorgeous condo in the Brewery District. Um, and from that, we've developed a pretty awesome relationship. So it's I'm growing. very, it's pretty awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I'm very thankful to have uh, her in my life and know Holly a little bit better. Oh, aww. That's about as emotional as I'll ever get. Yeah, me too. Just throw it out there. <laughs>